unit to Fourier series. First sum, find A naught in the expansion cos square x as a Fourier series in the class interval minus pi to plus pi. So, we have to find out the constant term of the expansion A naught for this Fourier series. So, the A naught formula is A naught equal to 1 by pi. This is the full range problem. So, 1 by pi. Uh, limit from minus pi to plus pi f of x dx. So 1 by pi minus pi to pi f of x varies cos square x dx. The cos is always a even function. So applying the property of definite integral 1 by pi integral minus pi to plus pi f of x dx can be taken as 2 times of 0 to pi. So 2 by pi 0 to pi f of x dx. So 2 by pi into integral 0 to pi cos square x dx. So, cos square x uh, conversion formula is 1 plus cos 2x by 2. So, 2 by pi integral 0 to pi cos square x is 1 plus cos 2x by 2 into dx. 2 to cancel. So, integral 1 by pi integral 0 to pi 1 plus cos 2x dx. So, this function can be integrated with respect to x. So, 1 by pi uh, 1 into dx means x integration of dx is x and integration of cos 2x is sin 2x by 2 lower limit is 0 upper limit is pi so we have to apply the upper limit minus lower limit so pi plus sin 2 pi by 2 upper limit minus lower limit is 0 sin 2 into 0 by 2 1 by pi so pi sin 0 is 0 so this value is 0 already sin 0 is 0 so this these two terms are 0 so pi minus 0 pi by cancel, the final answer is 1. So the constant term is a naught equal to 1. Second problem, find the sum of the Fourier series f of x equal to x plus x square uh, limit vary from minus pi to plus pi at, at that point, at that angle pi. Given f of x equal to x plus x square limit vary from minus pi to plus pi, so the sum of the Fourier series at that angle x equal to pi can be taken as formula 1 by 2 times of function of pi minus minus so we have to take the minus pi plus plus uh, function of pi minus first one is minus pi plus next one is pi minus so pi is a lower limit pi, uh, minus pi is the lower limit pi is the upper limit so, we have to write this formula. So, f of x equal to x plus x square. So, we have to apply f of minus pi can be taken as x can be taken as minus pi. Pi x can be taken as minus pi whole square. So, f of minus pi is minus pi plus pi square. f of pi is uh, pi plus pi square. Side of applying the formula 1 by 2 into uh, f of minus pi is uh, minus pi plus pi square and uh, f pi is pi plus pi square. So minus pi plus pi square plus pi plus pi square 1 by 2 into uh, plus minus cancel. So 2 pi square 2 to cancel. Final answer is pi square. Hence the problem. Sum number 3. If f of x equal to cos x if 0 less than x less than pi and f uh, 50 if pi less than x less than or equal to 2 pi and f of x equal to f of x plus 2 pi for all x find the sum of the find the sum of the Fourier series of f of x at that angle x equal to pi so given the f of x can be taken as cos x if 0 to uh, angle lies between x lies between 0 to pi 50 if x lies between pi to 2 pi sum of the Fourier series formula is 1 by 2 into f of uh, based on this angle uh, pi minus pi minus means uh, lies between 0 to pi so we have to consider this function pi plus means pi and above so we have to consider this function so uh, of into 
f of phi minus is cos x. So in this cos x place we have to apply the angle phi, so cos cos phi, and f plus uh, is uh, value is 50. So cos phi plus 50. So 1 by 2 into cos 180 is uh, minus 1. Cos 180 value is minus 1 plus 50 equal to 1 by 2 times of 49. So the final answer is uh, 49 by.